first, oh man, first snow of the year, January, what is this, 12th, January 12th, and we finally have actual snow on the road. We are headed to Wisconsin, Madison, well, a little town right outside of it called Fishburg, but it's really, really close to Madison. We are going really, really slow. We're about 20 something miles per hour. So let's see how long it takes us to get there. It's currently 6, 6.48 a.m. And um, yeah, hopefully we get there safe and sound. There's a lot of our company cars on the road this morning. So we pray everyone makes it there. I'll check in throughout the day to let you guys know what's going on. Okay. So guys, we made a stop. We're in this Wendy's and it's actually connected to a little gas station here but there's no snow we made it out the snow we're in um the beginning part of wisconsin i think it's called jacksonville or jansville something like that so yeah we gotta eat something and get back on the road so our room number is 403 we have been in here a while just going to show you a little kitchen area I was at my work meeting while they came here, but this is the kitchen area. It has a refrigerator. It's a pretty big one, you know, half size. But this room is perfect for three people. It has a pull out, let out to make a, the bed a couch. It has a microwave and dishes in here and a dishwasher, so that's really nice. It has a desk over here, because I am here for work. And here is like a little desk lamp area where you can put like your purse or keys. This is the let out bed or couch, which is super cute. It was love at first slice. Pizza lovers everywhere. We owe that good frozen pizza. One third of our classic crust is made from cauliflower. And in here is like uh, the closet area. It gets dark in here. See if I can find some lights. Oh, here it go. So it's a huge mirror there and the only bad part about they have a laundry basket is they only have a shower and I am a bath person and the other thing this hotel doesn't have is a hot tub they only have a pool and I'm a hot tub girl so uh, there's where all the towels is super cute so yeah so this is the room that's my husband. He's laying on the bed. Let's see if it has a view. So here is the view from the room. In Madison, it's snow, snow. In Champaign, you know, there was a lot of snow. It looks cool. So most of those down there are noodles and company cars. Okay, I wanted to talk about these infusion chocolates. Um, this is another company that my bosses own. Um, and we're here for our yearly meeting and he gave us some chocolates. They come with this pretty bow um, wrapped in it. And I wanted to kind of go over some of the chocolates with you guys. Um, you can order these. I think they're available through a website. If I have the, if I can find the website, I'll leave it below. Comes in this nice box and it talks about the infusion chocolate since 2008 and it talks about all the different chocolate seasonal selections spring summer fall and winter they have pumpkin pie strawberry colada hazelnut banana caramel apple cinnamon coconut rum some of them have alcohol in them they're all kind of special chocolates peppermint Peppermint has, let's see what peppermint has. Herbal peppermint is infused into dark chocolate. So 70% dark chocolate, the perfect holiday treat. Smoked bacon. I was trying to figure out which one I should try with you guys. But I am such more of a simple chocolate eater. Strawberry colada. House made strawberry jam infused with Malibu rum. 70% dark chocolate shell real pumpkin pie 
Um, it has sugar, ground nutmeg, cinnamon, um, and clove infused into a creamy 38% milk chocolate center. So I'm gonna show you guys how they look. Look how cool they are. Talk about a special thing of chocolate. They're just so pretty, right? Almost unedible, but they're all edible. I love them. Look at that. That one's a heart. And there's another heart up there. And look at the detail on them. I think that's really cool. Art in its form. I just want to share that with you guys. We are headed to dinner at the Great Dane. Got to be there at 6.30. So I'm actually going to do something to this hair. I think I'm going to wear it down. So I have to work on straightening it a bit and maybe putting a couple curls in it. So I am going to do that. And I got to uh, change my clothes and some things. So I'm going to do that next. So this is just a couple of pictures of us at dinner. We had a great time. Me and my husband both had the meatloaf with the mashed potatoes. It was great. So the next morning we got up and we had breakfast and they had a lot of stuff. They had boiled eggs and a whole bunch of toppings if you wanted to put on your food. They also had biscuit and gravy and they had eggs. What they didn't have was any kind of sausage or meat, which that was kind of sad. They had plenty of fruit and yogurt and milk and cereal. They had three different kind of coffees and juice and pop. They also had um, where you can make your own waffles. My husband loves that. They also had like some biscuits and bread and some oatmeal. And so there we have it. My husband had the um, waffles and the eggs and I had fruit and then my niece, I think she ate cereal. Um, this is the uh, lobby area where breakfast is served. They have a fireplace where you can play games. <laughs>